Hello everyone, I'm Eddie V. Welcome to this channel. And in today's video, I'm gonna be installing an engine technology, an engine hydro shield onto my cold air intake. Okay, so the engine hydro shield comes in this package just like so. Um, of course, in the, obviously in the FedEx package, but it comes in this package here. So I'm going to open it. And this is how it looks like when it's fully extended out. It goes over your cold air intake filter. And I'll show you what this technology does. Okay, guys, so I'll show you how this technology works. I'm going to spray some water with my hand, not a full force, and just go over it. You saw that right there? It bounces right off. We'll watch this again. So, right here and hold on. And it just bounces right off. So, the water, as you can see, it forms a bead on here and it causes it to just come off and it'll protect your cold air intake and engine from damage. It's Okay guys, so in order to install the hydro shield, I gotta take off my cold air intake. In order to do that, since it's a custom cold air intake, I gotta remove this vacuum line here, right here, and then I gotta remove this connection right here. I'm also, that's where I have to put it on. So in order to put it on, hopefully it fits on this intake, because I ordered like the largest size possible. But uh, right here, I gotta take this all off in order to make it work, and you need quarter, and eight millimeters. So let's get to work and you might need an extender. So here we go. Sometimes I'll shake it up a little, but then you can just simply remove, and you gotta be careful of these right here. So that's the only thing. I gotta not rip the sensor out. So in order to do that, I gotta now take this off. Alright, that's loose. Okay, so I was able to twist the uh, silicone lines here, so the sensor is now facing, so it's not stretched out, it won't get burned up or anything, but, um, so you're going to put it over the filter, all right, wherever the bigger end is, just like so, right over on here, and there you go, it is on and good to go, it shouldn't go anywhere, if anything, you can always use zip ties. But it, this beauty is on, and I'm happy that it's on. And now, just point the engine technology in the direction you're gonna be on it, and that's it, guys. Okay, guys. So here how it looks like that engine technology hydro shield right there, and uh, had to replace one clamp, and also I was able to remove just this update to move the sensor to the uh, mass airflow sensor and zip tie it down into there so that it don't go anywhere it'd be nice got a few more upgrades in the engine to do and afterwards just clean it out and sticker bomb the hood and we should be good to go after that on the engine not canceled Guys, I'm Eddie B. What? 2000. <laughs>